what y'all know about the Tully monster of Illinois. <laughs> you see, in 1955, Francis Tully was studying creek beds and found a fossil of the Tully monster. But to this day, nobody even knows what the Tully monster was. Was it a worm? A giant slug with jaws of steel? No one knows what it was, but it's purported to have been 12, 13 inches long. See that on the far right side? That's the mouth. Yeah. That's the map. <laughs> so here's some information uh, from Wikipedia. Um, there was an absence of a hard part in the fossil, okay? So no bones, no calcium, like nothing. It was just like gelatinous, I guess. Um, and it just, it was shaped really bizarrely. It's got like this bar thing on the top of its head that ended in organs. So it's assumed that those were eyeballs. It had like a rudimentary spinal cord, um, possible gills, but look, they don't even know what it is, okay? They, science can't even determine like what they're looking at. As you see in the text below me, like the fossil is a puzzle of science. Like they're like, what? I mean, they don't know what it is, okay? But there you have it. The Tully monster of prehistoric Illinois.